Good day, Crime Talk aficionados. This is Scott Reich of Crime Talk, and today on the docket, one thing. Let's talk Cheryl Lynn Cadle and Cadlegate. Let's talk about it. Good day, Crime Talk aficionados. This is Scott Reich of Crime Talk. And as we talked about in our introduction, only one thing on the docket, Cheryl Lynn Cadle. For those of you who don't recall, she published a book a few months ago called Letters from Christopher. And obviously it was regarding Christopher Watts. We were provided an advanced copy of the book. We read through it. It was basically kind of a rehash of the discovery, but... We thought it would be interesting because this was one person who had had direct contact with Chris Watts, and we believe that if these letters that were in the book were purported to be true, perhaps it would provide additional insight as to the thinking and the mentality of Christopher Watts. Well, fast forward several weeks now, and now Cheryl Lynn Cadle has been accused of plagiarism, specifically she is accused of plagiarizing almost verbatim from the book His Garden, Conversations with a Serial Killer by author and attorney Ann K. Howard. I've personally spoken with Ann Howard. She has provided me a comparison between her book, His Garden, Conversations with a Serial Killer, and the work of Letters by Christopher by Miss Cadle. As you can see from these comparisons that are up on the screen right now, it is nearly identical. The work by Miss Howard was literally cut and paste uh, for the most part. R rarely was a few were a few words even changed. I mean, this is outright plagiarism uh, here. And I am informed that privately, Miss Cadle has admitted that the plagiarism took place, has apologized to Ms. Howard, but to date, all of her public statements are defensive, and she claims that she is completely blameless. Ms. Howard's publisher, in this particular case, is making a demand that Ms. Cato's book be removed from any and all online channels, including but not limited to Amazon, Barnes & Noble, and the Durant's Bookstore. Ms. Howard's publisher is also asking for a complete accounting of book sales to date with any ancillary sales, such as to the Daily Mail. Obviously, Ms. Howard's publisher wants to disgorge Ms. Cadle of any profits that she may have made on this book as the work comes directly from Ms. Howard. Ms. Howard's publisher is also asking for Ms. Cadle to issue a public apology satisfactory to Ms. Howard on her social media pages as well as her website and on Goodreads and any page dedicated to this book on the Durant's bookstore for plagiarizing Ms. Howard's work. Ms. Howard's book, His Garden, A Conversation with a Serial Killer, has an Amazon rating average of 4.4 out of 5, while Ms. Cato's average 2.5 out of 5. His Garden... Conversations with a Serial Killer won the 2018 Pencraft Literary Award for Best Nonfiction and the 2019 Bronze Award from the ReadersFavorite.com for Best True Crime. Here at Crime Talk, we strive to bring you the facts. I have not read His Garden, Conversations with a Serial Killer. However, I'm going to. We had previously put a link to Miss Cato's book. Now we're going to put a link to Miss Howard's book, and hopefully you all will get it, read it, and let me know what you think. I'll let you know what I think about it. Hopefully, Miss Cato will do the right thing and publicly acknowledge that she made a mistake. We here at Crime Talk can completely sympathize with Miss Howard. Whether it's producing content for a YouTube channel or whether it's writing a book like Miss Howard does, it takes a lot of time, it takes a lot of effort, and it's not as easy as everybody thinks. And so when somebody rips off your work without providing you credit for it, 
It is nothing more than theft of your original work product and violation of numerous copyright laws. We hope that Ms. Cadle will do the right thing, make a public apology, be completely disgorged of any and all financial gain that she would have received from this book, as it clearly is based upon and a complete copy of Ms. Howard's book, His Garden, Conversations with a Serial Killer. Now, I've briefly spoken with Ms. Howard. Thanks for watching. Have a great day. We'll see you next time on Crime Talk.